Hello, beautiful people. So today we're going to do how this was made and I'm going to walk you through really simple. So you'll see a lot of these beautiful dresses that be all over Amazon, different places and stuff like that. And sometimes these dresses can be 80 some dollars. So I would want to spend $80 on that when I can go to the fabric store and make it myself. So we're going to make this simple. I'm going to walk y'all through how I made this dress and what to do. So for people that don't sew like that, I would say you hand sew, you still can do this too. But for the people that sew, okay. So basically for the bra, if you see these, I cut two large rectangle pieces, two large rectangle pieces. The bigger the breast, the bigger you cut these, the smaller the breast, the smaller you cut. So on each end, I fold over, I fold over. I took the matching fabric and cut about, uh, I would say, a little over uh, 12 inches. So depending on how long you want it to tie. So about 12 inches, fold it over the raw sides, sew that together because that's what you're going to insert through here, okay? And the same thing with the bottom. You're going to fold this over. You're going to fold that over. So with the skirt, as you can see in the back of the skirt, there's elastic in the back of the skirt because you want to be able to have this skirt to bait a hole up on your body. You want it to bait a hold up. So the top of this skirt, so I, I cut the skirt. So you take your measurements, go all the way around what your measurements is, and then we're going to close that off, okay? If we want to split, we're going to make a split. We're going to open that up, and then with this part, that goes around the back, if you see this part, we're gonna feed that through. Feed it through, feed it through, feed it through, okay? And then I inserted a hole right here in the skirt. If you see a hole, that I'm gonna bring this through, cause that's how we're gonna connect the top and the bottom together. And that is how I made this beautiful dress. I sent the dress like this on fashion over and I buy a lot of this stuff now I, I really would buy a lot of their jeans or something it's really unique but I didn't want to pay $89 for a dress like this when I figure hey about two yards of fabric depending on how floy you want it and I created it myself so a lot of my stuff I would do a walk through how it's made so these is the dresses that is trending and you can make them yourself just absolutely gorgeous and this is a cotton this is not a spandex, so make sure you do your measurement. And when you pick up the fabric, pick up some elastic because you're going to need the skirt to hug around your waist. And when you make the skirt, you, you close it off. You want to split, you make that split. You close it off, and then we're just inserting a little hole here, and we're taking this top part. See this piece, this top piece, connecting it through so that it can be a one piece. So this is a very beautiful beautiful um dress so i'm undecided on what shoes i'm gonna wear i got like some flat flip-flops and stuff so this is probably one of them just chill dresses so on some flip-flops black cute flip-flops or you know if you want to go out to a dinner or something and you want to be like more then you could throw on some little heels and um off you go so that is how this dress was made so if anybody was interested in making this dress that's what you need to do, guys. So I hope that helped you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Toodles. See you soon.